Okay. Hello friends. In today's session, I will try to explain you the concept of percentage change. It is very simple but important. So, percentage change is nothing but uh, final value minus initial value divided by initial value into 100. Let us say for example, A is 120 and B is 100. If, want, if I ask you, A is how much percent more than B, so if you put this into it, or this is very apparent that A is 20 percent more than B. But if I ask you that B is how much percent less than A, then my dear friends, you cannot directly say that if A is 20 percent more than B will be 20 percent less. That is going to be wrong. Why? Because when I have asked you that A is how much percent more than B, then I was taking my final value as 120 and initial value was 100. So it was 120 minus 100 divided by 100 into 100 which was coming out to be equal to 20 percent. <coughs> but in case when I have changed my question and asked you that B is how much percent less than A, then in that case B becomes my final value and A becomes my initial value. So if I put this into it, then it is going to be 100 minus 120 divided by initial value which is 120 into 100. If you solve this, you will end up getting minus 20 by 120 into 100 which is nothing but minus 1 by 6 into 100 which is nothing but 16.66%. So, <clears throat> it is actually very important for you to know that if A is X percent more, then that does not mean that B is X percent less than A. That is one simple thing which you must be knowing. We could have taken another example in that case, but uh, let, let me give you a shortcut to it in that case. Let us say, <clears throat> I wanted to do it directly. Now this is a conventional approach which we used to do when we were in school. A direct simple shortcut for solving anything of this kind would have been, if A is X percent more than B, then B is X upon 100 plus X percent less than A is a direct shortcut to it. So in that case, let us say if in our case we have calculated that A which is 120 is 20% more. So if A is 20% more that means the value of X is 20% then B will be 20 upon 120 which is nothing but 1 by 6 which is 16.66% less than it. This is something which has to be there on your single fingertips because a lot of times if you know this probably you will be able to solve a lot of questions with very less use of pen and paper. Right? Another important thing <coughs> can be the vice versa of this. That means if A is X percent less than B, then B will be X upon 100 minus X percent more than A. Like in our case, A was 16.66 percent less, yeah B was 16.66 percent less, so A in that case would have been 16.66 divided by 83.33. If you solve this, this will come out to be 20 percent more. So this is the direct formula. 